If you are thinking about quitting smoking, then you should know that there are many reasons why you should not smoke. This article will explain why you should quit smoking and what the consequences of not doing so can be. First of all, if you smoke, then you will most likely die sooner than if you did not smoke. In fact, it is estimated that a smoker who smokes for 20 years will die 15 years earlier than someone who does not smoke. Also, if you smoke, you will have an increased risk of cancer. The reason that smokers have such a high risk of cancer is because they breathe in the carcinogens, cancer-causing agents, from their cigarettes. The more you smoke, the higher your risk of getting cancer. There are two main types of cancer. Lung cancer and cancer of the throat or mouth. If you do not smoke, then you will reduce your risk of both lung cancer and cancer of the mouth or throat by 90%. You can also reduce your risk of getting cancer of the bladder, kidney, pancreas, esophagus, stomach, and cervix. Also, if you do not smoke, you will reduce your risk of heart disease by around 30% to 40%. If you smoke, your risk of heart disease increases by around 50%. You should also know that smoking increases your risk of having a stroke by around 25%. If you smoke, you should also know that your risk of having a stroke increases by around 50% over someone who does not smoke. If you do smoke, you should know that you are also at an increased risk of getting sick with a cold or flu. Also, you are at an increased risk of getting osteoporosis. If you smoke, you will also be at an increased risk of getting diabetes. If you do quit smoking, you will be at a lower risk of developing asthma, chronic bronchitis, emphysema, and pneumonia. If you do stop smoking, you will also be at a lower risk of having headaches, sinus problems, and ear infections. Also, if you quit smoking, you will be less likely to develop ulcers, gout, and cataracts. Also, if your children are still in the womb, then you should know that you are at a higher risk of them being born premature. If you smoke during pregnancy, you will also increase your chances of giving birth to a child with a low birth weight. If you quit smoking, you will also be less likely to get wrinkles, grey hair, and other signs of ageing. Also, you will be less likely of getting tooth decay, gum disease, and halitosis, bad breath. Finally, if you quit smoking, then you will live longer.